So for those of you that have been following along on YouTube, you may have been following our gait series. And in this series, I'm going through a ton of root causes as to what causes most gait deviations. One thing I haven't mentioned that came up in the comments was clonus. Can clonus cause gait deviations and how do you fix it? So first, yes, clonus can absolutely create some gait deviations, but first let's talk about what clonus is. Clonus is a symptom of damage to your brain or your spinal cord. And what it is, is when you quickly lengthen the calf muscle or the muscles that point the foot down, the muscle will contract. We usually measure this in kind of like a downbeat. So the number of downbeats is how we kind of grade the clonus. So when you rapidly dorsiflex the ankle or bend the ankle up, if you have this symptom, you can trigger a clonus or a reactive kind of pointing of the foot. 